now that we are displaying the list of our students so we also want our users should be able to search based on any column they want so let's go and fix our search also so let's go to inside our project and in here this is my search deep so i will warp it inside a form let's move it and i will set the action of this form to url then our own url which is the url we are using to fetch the list so let's copy it paste it here set let's set the method as well so method the method is gate so the same thing that we used in here so it's gate we will set the gate in here as well then let's give our input uh, id and name as well so id is equal to search name is equal to search as well and finally we have to change our button to submit so we will say the button type should be submit now let's go to inside our controller in the web we don't change anything in the web.php only we have to change inside our students controller so first thing that we have to do is add a request here inside our index method parameter request dollar sign request then in the state of all we have to type when dollar sign request search so basically in here we say whenever the request have a search variable in that case do a condition or do a callback function so we are going to use a callback function so we will say function and we will pass query as a parameter then inside this we will say return dollars and query we, we are an e and we will pass our list of our columns so this type we want to search based on name age email and uh, let's say date of birth and finally a score okay we have added all these name email age of date of birth gender let's add the gender as well so we will want to search based on these columns and in the second parameter of my callback function so oh sorry in here we have to use the request as well so we will say use dollar sign request now in the second parameter of when we will say dollar sign request search that's it and at the end let's add a gate function as well so our query get executed now let's go to our browser and in here let's search based on name so i want to set this name paste it here now i got my result so this the name is working now let's search based on email so we will search this email paste here search we got this one as well now this time let's search based on date of birth paste yeah we got this one also let's search based on the score as well so let's uh, do again now in here we have it's displaying as all the ages and scores which have 25 on them so these are good now there's one small problem that when i search based on last name if i add it here search it's not displaying anything because we are using in our condition is equal to now let's change it to like so just we before the request search before this we just have to type uh, like and in here after before the request and 
after the comma, we have to type percentage sign, then dot, and do same at the end as well. So now let's save. Let's go back, refresh. Now we got our results. So now we, our search is more advanced. Uh, it will search using like. So for example, I just want to search that much. Click. Now as you guys can see, it's giving me the results.